In this video, we're gonna compare the SanDisk Professional Pro G40 to the Samsung T9. These are two very similarly sized portable SSDs that are both compact and durable, and they have a very high quality feel, but there's a lot of differences between these two as far as the speeds you're gonna get in the real world. So technically, the Samsung is supposed to support speeds all the way up to 2,000 megabytes a second. It uses USB 3.2, two by two dual lane speeds to get those fast transfers. And then the SanDisk Pro G40 is technically rated for speeds all the way up to 3,000 megabytes a second. Now in the real world, if you're using these with a Mac, you're gonna find that the Pro G40 is way faster than the Samsung T9 because the T9 will only hit speeds up to about 950 megabytes a second on the read and the write because the Mac computers do not support the dual lane standard. So in theory, you have to use a Thunderbolt connection. You can use Thunderbolt 3 or Thunderbolt 4. You'll still get those fast 2,500 megabyte per second transfer speeds on both the read and the write on the SanDisk Professional Pro G40 drive. This one's also backwards compatible with USB, so it works even with an iPhone or an iPad. It's gonna work just fine for you as well. So what I really like about the Pro G40 is you're able to take advantage of those fast transfer speeds when you're using a computer, but you still have really great cross device compatibility. In terms of durability, these are both sized pretty similarly, but the Pro G40 is actually rated to be a higher durability level than the T9. The T9 does not have an IP rating, but it is drop resistant up to about three meters. On the Pro G40, it has an IP68 rating and it's also rated for a three meter drop. So this one's gonna be just a little bit more durable than the T9. In the T9 box, you will find a USB-C to USB-C cable as well as a USB-C to USB-A cable. On the Pro G40, you're gonna get a short Thunderbolt 3 cable included in the box. It'll also work with any other USB 3.2 cable as well if you don't have Thunderbolt available. Both of these come in one, two, and four terabyte configurations, and they also both include a five-year warranty. So both manufacturers are gonna have your back if you have any issues with them. And they both also support hardware encryption so you can encrypt the drives and make it where you have to use a password to log in on them. If you line the pricing of these up side by side, you're gonna find that the Samsung drive is typically just a few bucks cheaper per gigabyte than the Pro G40, but they're honestly really close in terms of price. So which one should you choose? I would choose the Pro G40 because I've had less issues with it bogging down if I'm doing a large file transfer. And I just love that Thunderbolt speed because you're gonna be able to transfer files way faster on a Mac, about two and a half times the speed on the Pro G40 as with the T9. Also, if you find yourself editing on your drives a lot, you're gonna prefer the Pro G40 because of that faster read and write speed. And it just does a better job at keeping up and not bogging down when it heats up. It has an aluminum core and the rubber coating on it as well makes it really durable while also doing a great job at keeping it cool. If you're interested in buying either of these drives, I do have links in the description below. Feel free to leave a comment below with any questions. I'm happy to answer them. Like this video, subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on any upcoming content.